Hello everyone, I'm going to show you how I made these lighted gift boxes with everything from the Dollar Tree. Everything that I use for this project is listed in the description box. And I'm going to start off by painting these decorative boxes. I'm just using some red, just some regular red uh, paint and a paintbrush. And I did do two coats. This is totally optional. You don't have to do it. Um, then I'm going to take my knife here and I'm going to cut out a square on either side of the box. And I'm doing this so that the light can shine through. Now, if you don't want to put any lights inside the box and you just want it to be a decorative box, you can definitely skip this step. But I wanted my lights to shine through and this was the only way that it would actually work. Next thing I'm going to do is I'm going to start laying in my ribbons and this is really simple. I'm going to do the same thing around the entire box. I'm going to start off with on the inside of the box with some hot glue and I'm going to place the first ribbon right in the corner. I'm going to get as close as I can to that corner um, because when I start to wrap the box, I don't want to uh, I don't want to see any of the box. I just want to see all ribbon. And so I'm just going to go all the way around just hot gluing each side until I get to the end of the, the other side of the box. And it's just important to keep the ribbon lined up to the edge um, because that's going to um, give it a more uniform look. Hey guys, if you haven't subscribed to my channel yet, go ahead and hit the subscribe button. I have a lot of Christmas videos coming up and when you subscribe it doesn't cost you anything and it's just your way of being able to get back to my videos and know what it is that i'm doing so definitely hit the subscribe button now once i get to the end of the box right here i'm going to cut the ribbon uh, just right here where I can secure it inside the box so you want so it'll have a neat edge even though this is probably going to be going down then I'm just going to do the exact same thing on the other side of the box now when you use the smaller box um, there will not be a gap in between the ribbons but you just follow the same process it's nothing different it's nothing hard about it and I'm using this um, popsicle stick uh, to save my fingers because ladies when you do this this hot glue comes straight through the ribbon because the ribbon is like a mesh and so there's nothing in between your fingers and um, and the hot glue so definitely use something to secure it to the box okay now that I've gotten this one here across now I'm going to basically do a crisscross. I'm going to turn to the other side of the box and I'm going to do the exact same thing. Hey guys, I want to thank you all. We recently reached the 100,000 subscriber milestone and I'm super happy about it. I want to thank everyone who has subscribed to my channel and also those who watch my videos. Thank you so much. Uh, it definitely is surreal. Um, I am going to be doing a 100,000 subscriber giveaway starting during the holiday season. So definitely look out for that. Okay, when I come to the end here, I'm going to do the exact same thing that I did on each and every one of them. I'm going to go in with my gold ribbon. And I'm just going to center it up as much as I can. Um, my ribbon is a little bit offset, but it doesn't bother me at all. Um, if you want it to be exact, you can def definitely take a measurement to find the center point. 
but I just went on and eyeballed it and um, uh, it doesn't bother me at all this is fine for me so I'm just gonna take the gold ribbon across just like I did the red in the center and once I get this one on I'm just going to apply the ribbon in the other direction Okay, now I'm going to make the bow that sits on top. This is going to be super easy. I'm just going to take about 12 inches of two pieces of ribbon and I'm going to find the center point and just um, put some glue in the center and then I'm going to pull either end towards the center. I'm just going to do that on both of those. I'm going to use my popsicle stick just to hold it down and then I'm going to take some glue and put it on the center and I'm going to put the first ribbon on a diagonal, okay, to the box. And then I'm going to place a little bit more glue, and then I'm going to put the other one right on top. And I did flip the bow over so that the folded edge was on the inside, so you wouldn't see that on the top, okay. And if you wanted to, you could definitely put an ornament or something like that on top, but this was fine for me. I wanted to leave it like this. And I absolutely love the way this looks. I'm going to be using these lights that I actually got during fall. And I'm going to glue it on the inside of the box. And you can use any battery operated lights that you have. The Dollar Tree has a variety of them. And I'm just going to take some hot glue and I'm going to glue the lights uh, around the inside of the box. That way when I turn the light on, um, I'll see the light from either side of the box. And that is it. I absolutely love these. I saw these in a department store and they were super expensive. So I decided to make this. I love the way it came out. Guys, I want to thank you all for watching. I do have a few pictures at the end and I will see you in the next video.